Well, as COVID-19 vaccine trials continue in children, doctors say vaccinating people who are around children is a must. And they say kids are a contributing factor for COVID's continued spread. Sharon Magenda has that story. Well, here in Milwaukee County, health officials say cases in children 18 and younger are trending significantly higher than the population as a whole. I think we're starting to realize the kids in close settings are actually going to be a potential driver of ongoing outbreaks. Milwaukee County is not only seeing increased cases, but also more hospitalizations in younger groups because of the new variant and the older population having been vaccinated. More than a third of the children hospitalized fall under the zero to four age category, followed by teens 15 to 17, making up a quarter of child hospitalizations. We are seeing more disease and more significant disease in younger populations. Specifically, the B117 variant, which is the dominant variant in the United States now, uh, is more severe and is more contagious and is far more likely to land you in the hospital. Doctors say vaccine trials in kids six months and older have been ongoing for the last year. Pfizer is pursuing emergency use authorization for kids ages 12 to 15. They say being able to vaccinate children will be critical in fighting the pandemic. They all realize that we need to move as quickly as we can into these younger age groups. Whether you have healthy children or children with medical conditions, experts say the best way to protect them is by protecting yourself. Make sure you're not bringing the disease home to them. Uh, and that's through getting vaccinated. Encouraging people that are now eligible to get vaccinated um, as quickly as they can so that when we get to the point where kids are approved, then there isn't going to be a major log jam. Dr. Conway says with Pfizer awaiting emergency use, the hope is to begin immunizing young teens by early summer. The fall semester then can hopefully look pretty normal if we've got middle school and high school kids actually eligible and immunized. Doctors are also encouraging parents of 16 and 17 year olds to vaccinate their teens with the Pfizer vaccine. Reporting in Milwaukee, Sharon Bagenda, CBS 58 News.